So every Airstream comes pre-wired for a rooftop satellite system. We actually have the coaxial RAN and a 12 volt power source. How do we gain access? In the rear overhead cabinets on the lounge model, all we need to do is lower the ceiling in the rear overhead. Across the face of the cabinet, we want to remove the screws out of the ceiling across the front, and we want to loosen two on either side and pull that metal roof down. Once we pull that metal roof down, on the passenger side, coiled up above the insulation, you're going to find a coaxial cable marked satellite system, and you're also going to find a brown 12 volt wire and a white 12 volt wire that's going to give you the power source to your roof mounted satellite system. When gaining access to the 12 volt wires on the roof lockers, what you want to do is remove the panel located there. You're going to find two brown wires and two white wires. One of those brown wires is going to have a butt connector on it. That should be your hot wire. You're going to hook that into your switch and put the brown wire on the other so you can actually switch that switch over to have power pass through it into your satellite system. Your switch location is going to be on the side roof lockers. Depends on what model you have. On the lounge model, it's going to be behind the shower. So you'd want to open up that cabinet door and remove the panel there. On the Grand Tour, same thing on the opposite side, behind that shower wall on the opposite side of that unit. So here on the outside of the Airstream Interstate, we have a couple accessories out here. We have a 110 outlet with two receptacles. The other one we have here is a cable outlet and an HDMI output so you can watch anything that you have on your antenna or coming in on your antenna on the outside or if you're watching a Blu-ray movie you could watch that out here as well as long as you have it hooked up to your TV.